Hello there. A oscilloscope is essential for electronics related works, especially for debugging the circuit. Here are some handy DSOs that I am using in my day to day life. These are pretty good DSOs. Today I got a new DSO from Flurcy called DSO153. Unlike other DSOs, it has an inbuilt signal generator. So the DSO153 is a 2 in 1 beginner friendly oscilloscope. In this video, let's see the complete details of this DSO153. Now, let's get started with this video. The DSO-153 comes in this box. Inside the box, we can find the DSO, then a USB A2 Type-C cable, a tag, then a tiny test probe, a FNRC logo, and finally a user manual. So here is the DSO, the black and blue combination is great. You can see the 2.8 inch DFT display and buttons. On the top side, there are input probe connector, output connector, 1 kHz test wave input connector, and a easy to use joystick switch for selecting parameters. This portable oscilloscope has a built-in 1000 mAh high quality lithium battery and it has a battery life of 4 hours. On the side we got the USB Type-C socket for charging and firmware ablation. There is also the reset pinhole and charging indicator LED. On the back side we can find the foldable stand which will help to place the DSO vertically. Now let's turn on the DSO by long pressing the power button. After turning on we can see that beautiful interface. The 2.8 inch TFT display has a resolution of 320 by 240. First we need to select which mode we want like oscilloscope or signal generator. Also there is a settings menu. In the settings menu we can select volume, theme, language etc. There are 9 languages including Chinese, English and Spanish available in DSO 1.3. We can use the gear switch and buttons to toggle and adjust them. First let's test the oscilloscope functions. For that, I connected the small probe to the input connector. We can also connect normal DSO probes using these type adapters here. Now you can see the 1 kHz square wave on oscilloscope. It has 1 MHz of bandwidth and we can measure voltages up to 400 volt. The DSO-153 equipped with auto, normal and single trigger functions, which is suitable for periodic analog signals and non-periodic digital signals. The DSO-153 comes with the intelligent one-click automatic configuration function. We can use the joystick and buttons for adjusting the X, Y axis. Now let's test the signal generator. To select that, either restart the DSO or press and hold the gear button. So here is the interface of signal generator. It can output 14 different waveforms including square, sine, half wave, full wave, etc. And the maximum waveform output frequency is up to 10 kHz. We can also see the waveform image on the screen. To monitor the output, here I am using another DSO from anywhere. To get the output, we need to change the probe to DDS output socket. Now you can see the exact same waves on output DSO. We can change the frequency, duty cycle and amplitude using the buttons. It can output 3.3V maximum amplitude. So everything is working properly. So I am using this DSO for 3 months now and I didn't face any problems with this DSO. As an electronic hobbyist, a DSO and a signal generator is very essential. So this portable 2-in-1 DSO-153 is awesome. I strongly recommend you this DSO-153 because of its portability and the small form factor. As always, you can find the purchase link from the video description. So that's all about today. Hope you enjoyed and learned something new from my video. If so, please consider supporting me by liking, sharing and subscribing. That's all up to you. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.